Hello everyone, Mr. Price here with your writing lesson for the day. We are actually digging into the writing of our literary essay. So today you're going to focus on your introductory paragraph and then you're going to focus on the first evidentiary paragraph. If you'll notice, with this introductory paragraph right here, I just gave a quick synopsis of what the story was about, and then I made sure that I stated the claim that uh, was from the rough essay plan that you guys did last week. So the claim from last week was the boy, the boys in the scouts honor realized that rivalry is a part of friendship. Uh, let's see how I work that into my introductory paragraph. The Scouts Honor is a tale about a group of boys who are set out to prove that they are tough and that they have what it takes to become a second class Boy Scout. This challenge entails riding a subway and then hoofing it to a remote location so that they can camp for the night. Although these boys set out on a quest that is supposed to teach them survival skills, a major life lesson is highlighted for them as well. The boys in Scouts Honor realize that rivalry is part of friendship. So as you can see, I kind of naturally gave that synopsis of the story and then ended the paragraph with the claim that the rest of the paper is going to support. The next paragraph looks long, but it's actually a lot of the evidence that we collected uh, on that page from last week. So, I'm just going to read it real quick. The revelation that rivalry is part of friendship can be seen when the boys don't want to appear unable to accomplish a goal set by their friends. On page 371, the boys are setting up a lean-to. The narrator describes how Max and Horace were using the branches they'd gathered to construct this lean-to over him, while he was simultaneously trying to get a fire started. This shows that none of them wanted to give up on the goals that they'd set out to accomplish in front of one another. Then, on page 372, Max is preparing his hot dogs over their tiny fire when Horse explodes a can of beans with his hatchet. The lean-to collapses and the food falls into the dirt. This happens because Max recommends using the hatchet to knock the top of the can off the beans. Because Horse didn't want to appear unable to accomplish this goal set by Max, the boys are covered in beans, their tent collapses, and they engage in a food fight and end up eating dirty hot dogs. The examples above show that these boys wanted to impress one another and avoid being unable to accomplish a goal set by another, and they help highlight how rivalry is part of friendship. Now, look back here at my literary essay, Rough Plan. I have both of those pieces of evidence right here. And if I come over to this page, I'm going to highlight Oh, excuse me. Right there, I totally copy and pasted from the page where I gathered evidence. I wrote one sentence to lead into that paragraph to get the reader ready to, to receive the evidence. I pasted the evidence, and then I wrote one sentence explaining why that's proving the, uh, the claim that I'm making at the start of the paper. So don't make this too hard on yourself. Try and be resourceful like that. Your job today is to get your introductory paragraph written, and also that first uh, paragraph of your evidence. If you have any questions, stop by office hours or send your ELA teacher an email. Hope you guys have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye.